Hey everyone, uh, today I'll be sh uh, showcasing this special uh, retro Sonic Hedgehog plush and um, we'll do a little bit of history on it before we go on to the main, uh, you know, details and whatnot, the tags and the, uh, the design and whatnot. So uh, yeah, as you know guys, myself, I come from uh, the UK in England and this is where this plush originates from. Now this is a very old style plush uh, with old retro design and it's one of the earlier designs as well uh, as I will show you as we go along with the details now obviously you don't need to be really smart to know that this is from the Sonic Hedgehog 1 and 2 era and uh, as you can see you've got Tails and Sonic there on the tag very cool tag as well now these are quite common in the UK but when you see one tag that is very uncommon it makes them rather special now, I don't know if these are hard to get hold of in any other countries, but they're very common in the UK. So, yeah. Um, as you can see as well, uh, it's also um, made by Tomy, a UK company. So, yeah. It's a logo at the top there, and so again, the price is 991192. And he has quite a big uh, touch tag at the side as well. I can just show you that there. Quite a big one. And also a third one on the shoe showing the Sonic Hedgehog logo, which is pretty cool. Now, the next little detail we're going to go through here is the suction cup. So this is known as the suction cup Sonic plush. And you, uh, I don't know if you can do it now because it's quite old, but you can uh, stick these once having enough moisture on the uh, suction cups to windows, whether it be car windows or maybe your house windows or whatever. And it'd be a cool little design, a little effect on the window. So that's what gives this plush a little bit of uh, uniqueness as well, because you don't really get many plushes with that sort of effect anymore. Um, also, uh, I love the quality of the, the gloves. Um, this hand here is, uh, has his finger pointing out, which is pretty cool, like the, the classic wagon finger pose that Sonic does. And uh, yeah, the hands are done really awesome. I mean, like you can see literally four fingers and a thumb, which is quite, you know, rare these days where it's normally like a, a mitten or a glove or something really lazy so uh, also on his face here you can see um, on his eyes there are the plastic eyes which actually deteriorate over time and luckily this guy is in really good nick so I'm quite happy with that and since uh, this is Sonic's sort of early designs you've got sort of a goofy smile here and um, for all you Sonic fans out there that know your designs of Sonic as you can see at the back here, it's rather unique. Now, normally at the bottom bit, you have um, two quills, but because this is such an early design, it has three quills at the back instead, which is rather odd. But um, yeah, apart from that, the shape and everything is quite solid. The stuffing is quite solid. The material is quite old, but very well done, very uh, sturdy. I do love the proportion of the spikes; they're quite good, as well as the ears as well. Ears are done quite well, and uh, the nose is quite solid, and the stomach and the muzzle is quite solid, so yeah, a very cool plush if you can get hold of him tagged. Um, other than that, it's quite a basic plush at the same time, but rather unique. So uh, yeah, alright guys, uh, thanks for watching, this is the end of the video, hope you enjoyed it. If you have any questions, feel free to comment down below and I shall answer the questions as soon as possible. And uh, as usual guys, thanks for the, all the support and uh, the kind words, I do appreciate it. I will continue making videos for everyone that um, likes my content. And uh, yeah, I'll be back with more uh, videos, reviews and merchandise. So yeah, take care.